Sharad Rajamani, consultant neurosurgeon from Manipal Hospital's Whitefield. I'm here to discuss the topic of brain tumors. Brain tumors are basically classified into two types. One which arise intrinsically from within the brain and the second one which arises somewhere else and spreads into the brain. So we call them primary brain tumors and secondary brain tumors. Another way we can classify brain tumors is benign, which is not a cancerous, slow-growing form, and malignant, which is cancerous. The difference between cancers of the brain and cancers in the rest of the body, by far, is quite simple. Cancers of the brain do not spread to the rest of the body as a rule of thumb. Very rarely can we see cancers of the brain spreading to the rest of the body. Cancers of the brain need to be detected early and their symptoms usually are seizures, headaches associated with vomiting, weakness of one of the limbs or they could develop unconsciousness in the much later stages. Most presentations are indolent in nature. That means they are very, very subtle. We have to be very careful when we are looking for them. Most cancers of the brain start de novo. That means we don't know why they are happening. Most other cancers could be picked up due to a cause. For example, lung cancers related to smoking, bladder cancers related to smoking, etc. However, brain tumors, we do not know any definite cause. Very rarely could they be genetic in nature. Any growth within the body, the best way to treat them is to take them off. Take out as much as you can while preserving the quality of life of the individual and then treat them further with radiation and chemotherapy. The earlier they detected, the better the results. The more you excise, the more you remove away tumor, the better they respond to chemotherapy and radiation therapy. We have to be on the lookout and investigate when we see these symptoms of seizures, weakness of the limbs, severe headache, usually one-sided, associated with vomiting, more commonly during the early morning hours. Let's be vigilant and catch these diseases early. Thank you.